my bike. You are using it, aren't you, Tom? Yes, Mum. Do you know the number of people I've seen that would still be alive if they'd worn a helmet? You see those paramedics? Yeah. The old lady downstairs. Maybe if she would have worn a helmet. Tom. should have is Na2SO4, our old friend, sodium sulfate. Tom Heath. Tom. Tom! Since you're so far ahead of us, why don't you come up here and talk us through the answer? Come on. Mr. Freeze! <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. Sound enough for that. <laughs> hey, Felix! Look, well, we've got some pretty serious competition for Battle of the Bands. So. Come on then, entertain us, mate. I'm sure what you can do. Damien! No? Yeah, I'll do my guitar and shove off. Go on. Close. 
close the door on your way out, please. Exhausted. Poor old Mary's got a new neighbour from hell, apparently. 
Oh, yeah, and Tom's... A bit fighting at school, getting into trouble. Do you want me to go and have a word with him now? Why not? I'm sure he's got a few sentences that need finishing. Tom. You don't just attack someone for no reason. If I was schizophrenic, I might. Schizophrenics hear voices. I hear music. Does that count? I don't th think that, that... Do you defend schizophrenics? No. Just break up families, then? Isn't there some kind of law about getting involved with your clients? I'm not involved with your mother. She'd like to be there. Listen, you've got two choices. Stop fighting, put in some work, get into university, or be a sad loser, like your dad. Appalling. Have you spoken to the council? They told me to keep a noise diary. Your constant racket is driving me crazy. Why don't you let me? You're always doing this. What? Speaking for me, finishing my sentences. Mary? I am a perfectly functioning, intelligent woman, quite capable of fighting my own battles. But you asked me to. Yes, I know. Sorry, I'm just at the end of my... You are destroying my life. Is that marijuana? Mary! People feel they can inflict their life choices on everyone around them. <gasps> Useless, selfish, bloody. You don't know anything about him. I had nine years of it with your father. Tank. There you go, buddy. Right there. You've got the best of my love, but only on the weekend. Yeah. It's a great singer. Yeah. I'm a singer in a band. Yeah. It's called Risk Factor. Heard of us? No. No. Um, you know, in fact, if, if you wanted to, just give me a number, then I could, uh, get you on the guest list. Yeah. V-I-P. Can I help you with anything? No, I'm just, uh, waiting for him over there. Yeah, is that your son? No. No, 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 it's, it's just something I do. I, um, I mentor special, uh, well, difficult children. Doesn't look difficult. He's actually got sedatives. Really? Yeah. I mean, you wouldn't think it. He runs the most dangerous gang in Sutton. Yes! Whoa. It's okay. It's okay. He gets excited. <laughs> of mind, darling. Joan is going to write us a letter. Move to get him evicted. Sleep well.
How very sad. Come on, class, gather round. Tom, get the page back. <laughs> so, tomorrow, a thousand words on uses for the compound silicon, apart from breast implants. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pav. <laughs> Teach me. You've got loads of time. You're always here. I know about your dead boy. Maybe teaching you. If you ever mention a dead child to me again, that is exactly what you'll be. I'd rather be dead than not be able to play the guitar like you. Teach me. The blue one. You teach me and you get to live your secret life in peace. The red one and I'll tell everyone that you're not dead. Think about it. Bet the tabloids would love a story like this. Crippled tax dodger living under false identity. Wacko sado benefit. Cheeto. Sad little loner. No life. 
So are you. At least I had one. And my mum's getting a solicitor onto you, so you better stop playing music all night and start teaching me guitar. Or you'll be locked up. Do you hear? I wonder why. It sounds great. Carry on. <clears throat> okay, uh, full stop. Three, four. Get a chair. Tune it. Go ahead, then. Can I go in the other room? Anything. Why do you want to play like me? Because you're brilliant. You wrote rock guitars, guitarist in 1993. Yeah, was I? How could you forget something like that? Listen, if I play like me and people like it, that's one thing. You play like me, it's a tribute band. But I just want to... No. No more about me. I don't want to ever hear another word about me, no history about me, no facts about me. You just play. Good. <laughs> yeah. Just 
Just leave it. Thanks. Dealing drugs? No. Huh? Running some kind of extortion racket? No. Auntie's been giving me thirty pounds every Christmas and birthday since two thousand eight, and my paper runs between seven and nine pounds, depending on how many flyers they put in. Flight little entrepreneur, aren't you? Yeah. And they gave the jumper back last Christmas, which I kept the money for. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm good. good. I'm not an extortionist. No, you're not. You look fantastic in your glasses. Your mum has excelled herself. for a hustle, hustle of the bands. You're in a band? I sing, play guitar. I'm so gonna get an exclusion order on you. Yeah, stay away from me, you pervert! <laughs> My dad's getting me a new guitar. Great, why don't you get him to teach you how to play it? He would, but he's too busy at the moment. All right, bring a new riff. To go in your studio here and play it. Invert it. Play it somewhere else. No, on the guitar. Play the chord. Give me a D, two frets up. Now back to the E on the 12th. It's like the same chord further up. Inversion. Can you still do that with the... Well, don't worry about my hand. Just, just keep playing. Well done. Thanks. Can I leave it here? No, oh, just take it. I can't. Why not? My mum doesn't know I've got it. Where do you keep it? In the air vent. On the roof. Why? Dad's in a band. Mum hates everything he stands for. <sighs> She'd go mental if she found out I was doing music. She wants me to be a solicitor. Something like a stupid friend. Yeah, that's real interesting. Not the solicitor part, of course, but the uh, secrets. You got secrets. So the way I see it, we have us a blackmail Mexican standoff. 
You try to ruin my life, I will ruin yours. I like that. It's a balance of power. It takes us back to the way we were before. We could just go on ignoring each other. Yeah, but it's not balanced. What's that, ruin that you're Max Stone? Yeah, and I will tell your mom about the devil's music. Well, I'll tell everyone you tried to touch me. Pedo, retard. Stefan Pavlovsky. Stefan Pavlovsky. Smoking helps with the pain. You're not even supposed to smoke cigarettes out there. Oh, Jay. Did you tuck yourself in? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, nurse. Don't call me that. <laughs> oh. You haven't done your exercises, have you? No. Why'd you bother coming? Oh, so if I don't, they cut off my disability benefit. We are. OK, let's leave it there. Yes. Seeing my dad tomorrow. My next lesson will have a proper axe. Run away to Spain with some girl. Not a word. Didn't you say goodbye to Tom? Tom, don't throw anything. I'm coming in. I wrecked a few rooms in my day. It's good work. You took my money. Gonna have to get used to that in this business. So do you think I can do it? Got a few things working against you. Like? Well, you have a crippling shyness that renders you incapable of playing in front of anyone except me. All right, apart from that, you gotta find your own voice. 
Every great guitar player has a unique voice. Clapton, Hendrix, Johnson. Who's Johnson? Robert Leroy Johnson. The story goes that when he first started playing guitar, he was so bad, people laughed. He was embarrassed. So one night, he goes to a crossroads, Clarkdale, Mississippi, midnight, sells his soul to the devil. After that, he was the greatest blues guitarist the world had ever seen. So like you, but the other way around. Get it, because you were good, then you sold your soul, and now... Yeah, I get it. Now, someday you may have minions that'll take care of all this, but until then, I suggest that you apologize to the management. Start cleaning this up. just might. Famous like a hundred years ago. You recognize me? That's because I'm knowledgeable. Forgot you're a regular little idiot savant. What happened to all your cash? What? When you get royalties and stuff. I lost it all. Must have had such a good time. I sure hope so. I don't remember any of the good parts. I don't remember a damn thing. What kind of agents? Need a uh, budget amp. Six pack of those lecture sound lights. Even in here before? No. Call this one Sharon, after my ex-girlfriend. Cheap, easy to pick up, and it packs the right punch. <laughs> Whatever. How much does it cost? Uh, oh, say 30 for the amp, 4 for the strings. Let's call it 35, eh? Max Stone. That's who you look like. But nothing. It's all point. You got fired from the tribute band. <laughs> yeah, I know there was all that nonsense, but people forget how good he actually was. Rock guitars, guitarist in 1993. Uh, that guy's dead. I'm gonna keep it that way. I'd do it. I'd sell my soul. Sometimes the devil cheats. You'll get the hang of it. Show me. Can't do it. Don't play anything you don't feel. Cheated me, took me for a ride. Packed me in his limousine, drove me to the other side. The devil cheated me, what a hell of a ride. He showed me 
good times, he showed me fun He said you can have all of this sun All for nothing, all for free Just sign your name on this dotted line for me Come on, sign these deeds The devil cheated me The devil cheated me Perform a U-turn immediately The devil cheated me The devil cheated me Danger Danger You've reached your destiny Destination. Hello, Mr. Angry. How's it going with your band? We're just working on some new material. I'd love to hear it sometime. <laughs> See you around. And I just came by to say um, thank you for the other day. Is this a bad time? Yeah, it, it, it is, actually. I, I was just... Um... Smashing some crockery. Well, yeah. What? I can clear it up for you. No. Oh. Don't. It's... <clears throat> you just, just go. Oh, but come back later, you and Tom. Yeah. So you come back for dinner. Really? Okay. I can bring the food. Great. <clears throat> and plates. Okay. Knives and forks. Sure. You want a couple of chairs? Why don't you just come up here? Okay. Nice work. Yeah. You don't actually want to have dinner with her, do you? No. No. Why, it's you who are in here with the guitar. Go. For what we are about to receive, may the Lord make us truly thankful. I don't think I've ever heard anyone say that in real life. Is this all right for you? Yeah. I, uh... It's chewing. I feel like I'm burning energy just... I was chewing it. <laughs> it must be 
better than all those ready meals for one. It's nice to be sitting here together eating. I'm not used to do this. I tried when you were younger. But your dad was always out late, so uh, it didn't really happen. Perhaps I'm sometimes a bit too quick to judge people. I think he's lonely down there. He just needs a bit of love. Mom! God's love. Um, I just wondered you know, if you'd like to Wasp. come out for a coffee if you've nothing better to do. Mm. No. No, no, I have nothing better to do. See the thing about wasps, sometimes when you wave at them, they just get more stubborn. Hope this wasn't too far. Uh, I need to walk more. I did try to warn you. That's really come on. Uh, Gemma, I think we're going to lose your pom-poms. They're not really working, are they? I thought they were sounding OK. Oh. I didn't. What do you think? It's unique, and uh, I love Gemma's pom-poms. Might you be joining us? The male section could do with beefing up. This is Steve. He's moved in below us. Oh, the neighbour from hell. Can I have a quick word, please? Why have you brought him here? Um, because... Well, because he's, uh, he's new to the area and uh, he doesn't seem to have any friends. Just be careful, OK? Look, I know you mean well, but just... So, are you going to come to our charity gig? Oh, yeah, definitely. I'll be there in the mosh pit, going for it. Come on. All right. <sighs> Goodbye, ladies. You, uh, have a nice evening. Steve. I don't think Jonah likes me very much. He's just jealous. Tom, you coming to school next week? Or are you being a bad boy again? No, I'll, I'll be there. Cool. Yeah. See you there. Oh, why didn't you introduce me? It's like being in a Jane Austen novel. Youth is wasted on the young. I bet it wasn't wasted on you.
Why is it so dark in here? Yeah, because I have a headache. Oh. What's going on with you and that girl? Nothing. Oh, I see. Well, she, you know, she is kind of cute, and she, she does seem into you. I don't think it's like you and my mum. How's that? They both just feel sorry for us. You should play on it. If she trusts you, you could take me to the Battle of the Bands next weekend. If you're gonna play that thing, you're gonna have to do it in front of an audience. An audience is a multi-headed monster with a thousand sharp fangs ready to stab you at any second. But you are gonna tame the beast. You are gonna make it love you. All right, we're on the main stage. It's Saturday night at Reading. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Multiple Grammy winning, platinum award selling, artist of the year, Tom! Out arena. Now this gig next weekend is gonna be a walk in the park. Now get going. Leave the guitar. I um I got you something. It's a bit silly, but um I thought it might, you know. What is that? It's electronic. Helps you cut down, if you want to. That's not too bad. Want try? I haven't smoked in years. My teenage rebellion. The thrill of keeping something secret from your boring parents. Mm. Yeah, but now you're the boring parent with a teenager. Yeah. 
Sometimes my passwords get thrown right back at me. Have you got children? A son. I had a son. He died. Steve, I'm so sorry. Uh, if you don't want to talk about it... You should know. He drowned in my pool because I wasn't looking after him. He was uh, three years old. Three years, ten months, seven days, and... Uh, I should have been watching. The really horrible part of it is that, uh, you know, whenever I, I think of him, I, uh, I hate myself, so. I try not to think about him. So, does she trust you? I don't know, you'd have to ask her. You have to take me to this battle next week. She can't know. I'm not gonna lie to her at all. The whole life is a lie. Yeah, I, I like her. She's my mom. She hates the music. Well, then we will just have to find some way to make her realize that the music, it's, it's not as bad as some of the other stuff you've been doing to yourself. Let's just play. Go ahead.
dare you? I know this looks bad. You, you need to take a step back. A step back? You gave my son drugs. He took it. Dude, he is completely out of it. He, he, he could have fallen off the roof. What were you doing up there? I teach him guitar. He's a musician. It's, uh, that's all he cares about. He can't even sing in the church choir. He can sing. He can play. He writes his own music. I don't care. He is not going down that path. You can't treat him like a child forever. He's a teenager. He hasn't listened to him. You are in no position to talk to me about raising children. You just stay away from Tom. Stay away from me. What are you listening to? You okay, Tom? Can't play music anymore. Why? The guy was teaching me. And he's gone. You can find someone else. I not like it. Is that the guy I saw you with in the park? I thought that was your dad. He used to be famous. He did look kind of cool. You ever heard of a band called Nothing? Huge US band in the 90s. Kind of thrash, grunge. Is that a video? Yeah. Let's hear them. It's very rough. You and the moody guy, you two rock. I'm sending myself your song. You can't show that to anyone. Why not? Just promise me. Grow older. I'm fine now. So, how do you stop yourself? Play guitar. Join our band. We need a decent songwriter. It'd be nice to have you around. Don't look so shocked. Extra Latin. After school. It's useful for law. Jonah told me. 
And I've been thinking maybe I could help out in the choir. You think I'm up to it? Tomkins, I'm sure you are. I did like Steve. Yeah. I liked him a lot, but I'm back on track now. And we're okay, aren't we? Of course we are, Mum. How about I play that the second time round? That's cool. How did you do that? It's called a higher inversion. You taught me. You're really good. Hey, oi, oi, love birds. Break it up, break it up. Jesus, say. Mr. Freeze, yeah? What are you doing today? Just chilling out? Chilling out, because Mr. Freeze. Tom's got some good ideas. We do need help with our song. Got a sick guitar there, mate. Not a copy, either. Tell me, how does a boy like you come to possess a guitar like that? Well, then, take it away. Show us what you got. Sooner rather than later. It's a bit girly, isn't it? I want something, you know, something that rocks. Like that. You know, in your own time. First time I sang with them, I had to get in a wardrobe. And the door was shut. And I'm scared of the dark. That's ridiculous. Why? Because you're so... What? I just can't... Tom, wait! Felix! Zombies living in fear Girls so lonely Girls so lonely With open eyes Woke up in a world that's bright outside Next time that you have a little crush on a neat boy, don't invite him to join the band. Listen, right? you moron. He's got more soul and more talent than you'll ever have. You're right, mate. 
think she does have a thing for him. And he's a better songwriter. Who's that? His teacher. He just needs to build his confidence. Think we can help him do that? What does it look like? I'm practicing for the song that's going to win me Battle of the Bands. There you go, look. Tambourine for you there. See how you fare with that. I'll tell the judges. You'll get disqualified. Hey, why is that? It's my song. Just not just your song, though, is it? I've been doing a little reading about your friend. Yeah, massive tax fraud, jumped bail, owes a lot of people a lot of money. Yeah. Look, I don't blame him if he wanted to disappear. That's fine, but you know as well as I do that if that video gets out, it's bad news. So tell the judges, and I'll go straight to the police. <laughs> Done a stupid thing. I show Felix the video. She's trying to impress him. Somebody with half your talent can start a career with this thing. What's the point? All the success in the world and you lose yourself. You are going to be great. You can do this gig. You can do it solo. I can't. You can. Hey. You gotta stop hiding, Tom. You can figure it out. What is it? You'll see. Bye. 
Prisoner.
There's gonna be another way out. Steve? I'm down here. No, get up. No. Oh. No, Tom. No. No. But you're in prison. In prison is the one you make for yourself. I'm not. I'm not running anymore. This is. Help me let go. until he surfaced in the Battle of the Bands in South London, has been sentenced to three years in prison for tax.
had a dream, her path to the stars, a promised land, writing songs, living the dream, and knocking down walls with his guitar, writing songs of freedom, melody streaming wherever you are, hearing songs for freedom, melody streaming like a rising star. Telling the world, writing songs, the city of stone, and promise of hope, close to gold, then he woke. 